We hit the bureau for you, Dave. I'm done. Yes, I saw that. Meet me at the court center and I'll debrief you. I'm out, Davey. From now on, done. I appreciate that. I'm trying my best for you, but, but you and Trevor attacking Merriweather? Repeatedly? It doesn't help. That's Trevor's thing. Whoever's thing it is, it's unauthorized and it's dumb. They've been sniffing around my office. We really need to talk. Really? <sighs> all right, all right. I'll come to the court center. Fuck. Uh, see? Maybe that's why we're such great friends, huh? We're old school, like old-fashioned things. Newspapers, celluloid. Good guys, bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know. You tell me. We did what you said. Right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said and cut me loose, right? Things are not gonna work out quite that way. What? A bit of a problem. That's right, Davy boy. You can say that. Steve, I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've handled everything so oh, fucking not well so far, shit. haven't you? All right, I admit things have been a little unorthodox. I'm but fucking orthodox! You ruined my career. Agent Sanchez, arrest these men both. What? Steve, oh, come whoa! On, please. You fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh, well, then let me rephrase. Why? Why? Because. Because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business okay, deals. Right? This, Agent Sanchez, apprehend the suspect. Whoa, 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 no whoa, 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 whoa. What the hell is going on, man? This is. To speak to Michael. To try and explain things to him. Not this. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun yeah. down and we'll talk. After you yeah, we, on, there you should be at least an explanation or some sort. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. And now you want me to clean up your mess again, right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Fucking good luck with that. Put the weapons down, boys. Oh, sure, this is, not, this is not This is not good. Put your weapons down, all of you. Oh, brilliant! We've been surrounded. You with? Shit! You fucking rat! I knew what you the hell? Balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put oh, this is not good. Fuck you! We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary. Boys with the gun down, gentlemen. Who the fuck are they? The fucking Merriweather. What are they doing here? Steve, oh, now Merriweather is part of this no, business. Oh shit! Oh my gosh! Fuck. Bullshit! This is Why nuts, man! I ain't going anywhere, Davy, until some more of these guys kill him. This is crazy, man! I've I think I'm already here. Get a job. Balcony, got it. What happened to Haynes? He get caught in the crossfire? Don't worry about Haynes. Haynes went the other way. He's probably out. We gotta think of ourselves. I'll just say me. I might need to do some pictures. So. Okay. Run! Oh wait, Trevor! You're gonna die, Headshot, nice. Man, we're off to a wild start. Hey! If anyone's gonna kill you, old friend, it's gonna be me! Oh! You're here to finish the job, T? No, 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 I'm just here for the opportunity. Now run! Okay. Try my best. This is the guy who iced Brad and would ice me? I'd be better off putting my sights on him. Okay. I'm moving up 
This is a little unrealistic, but what freaking ever. Where's the other two? One at the bottom. Okay. I'm holding position, but I don't know how long I can keep it up. Look out! Look out! Look out! Look out! Look out! Look out! These guys don't have a funding problem. Someone's gotta bring down the buzzer before it blows us up. Gotta be careful. Gotta I don't careful. feel like you're contributing, Trevor! So tell me, Davy, who are these bureau men trying to kill me? Our corrupt division, gone rogue or on the IAA payroll. They'll be bringing bodies out of here by the truckload. I thought you were the corrupt division. Corrupt? Only a little. Definitely below average. I'm between the what? phone oh, and the reflecting pool. Come on! Merriweather, and war in the USA. Pick it up, Mikey! Shoot. My guns get hot! What happens to Haynes? Norton gonna pop him at the water cooler on Monday? I'm not popping Steve. Jesus. I'll get close to him and I'll try to control him. That's if we get out of here alive. Oh, shoot. My god, no. Ah, uh, shoot. We try, we try, we try. Follow Dave, follow Dave, follow Dave. Stop, stop, stop. Take cover. This many bodies, there'll be cars in the lock. Put as much dirt between you and this place as you can. And do not contact me until you're absolutely sure you're clear. Take that shithead down. I'm taking this one. So long. Stay safe, D! They got me pinned! Just grab one car. Get my ass out of here. Shit, chopper. Ah, oh, this chopper. Really? Woo! Run! Oh, crap!
Okay, run, run, run. Okay. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Behind you? Okay, behind you. Well, that was fun. What are you doing smoking, huh? Come on. No, no, no. That's bad for you, don't you know, huh? Yeah, well, maybe it's got a little something to do with being caught in the middle of a three-way firefight between two government agencies and a private militia. You know, it gets me a little stressed out. Okay, but we still need you alive, Mikey boy. I mean, you know, at least for now. Unless, of course, you have another surprise for me. Huh? Maybe something to do with another inappropriate friendship? Yeah, that wasn't exactly Dave's fault. No, no, no. He's just the friendly face of a corrupt government agency looking to further his career by dealing with an equally corrupt and full to the fucking brim with bullshit low rent hood. Listen, Trevor, listen, I've been meaning to... Uh, you know, I haven't mean to... I've been meaning to tell you, you know, I haven't... Mm. What, homie? What do you have meaning to tell me, huh? That you stabbed me in the back or that you were and always will be a worthless wretch who deserves to be put under. Yeah, well, what the fuck, fuck did you come man. back for? Oh, you know why. Ah, oh, no, not one last score. Mm-hmm. And if oh, it goes good, the UD heist. I don't have to put a little bullet in your head, but if it goes bad, well, that's okay too, because then you and I get to go to hell, and I get to spend the rest of eternity with you, tormenting you. Well, I guess it's on then. Yeah, I guess it is. Call Lester. Like Trevor Let's go. does want to pull the um, the UD heist hey, after all. It's me. I know how to go. Just fabulous. Ran into an old friend. Matter of fact, he saved my ass. Mm, we're all friends now. Suppose a group hug's out of the question. <laughs> he wants to uh, still go on the final victory tour. The UD heist. All right, when it looks like it's a go, I'll contact you. And remember this, gentlemen. If we pull this off. Sorted, nasty, depraved history, but history, nonetheless. All right, there. You happy? Fucking thrilled. Don't forget, amigo. Keep my eye on you. Yeah. Yep. The UD heist is a go. Let me check the expand. Buzz off. Well, at least I got 18 headshots, but yeah. But what does the bus off um, does though? Now what? You made it. Good. I saved you again, Davy. Again. So what are you gonna do for me about Haynes, the rest of the FIB, the IAA, and everyone else, huh? History's written by the living. Okay. We can pin most of it on Agent Sanchez. I get that story right and the agency and bureau will back off. The problem we need to deal with is Trevor. What? Trevor? Why? Try Merriweather, Chinese gangsters, general insanity, and so on. I can spin Steve that you're controllable, but not Trevor. Steve? He's our wounded hero right now. I gotta cozy up to him, calm him down. Just get me out. Whoa, what the hell is going on? What the hell? We had a deal! We had paperwork! Hey! Fuck off, Johnny! Hey, you're a couple real badasses! Put a beat down on an old man! We don't take that! We have a deal okay. with them! Just above. Please, get those millennial ass wipes! With pleasure. You fuck what? Hey! Here's an old man who might hit back! Eliminate Rocco. Got it. Sorry. Shut up. And the thing is, I'm using my phone. If it's friendly, it might, it might be easier, but I'm using friendly. I'm using my phone right now. If I were to eliminate. Um, I should have whacked you when I had the chance! How you like me now? 
I thought you were a tough guy. Okay, that takes care of that. Because the mission clearly states eliminate. I'm only a paraplegic, but you can't feel anything. Ah, uh, you're throwing me softballs. Rum runner. But uh, speaking of accidents, those guys had one. Oh, if only we'd met 20 years ago, Michael. Maybe I wouldn't be in this mess. Yeah, you and me both, brother. Look, it's a pain, I know. But could you come by the studio now? I got something I'd like to show you. I leave the studio? Yeah, of course. I'll be right over. Might as well. out maybe I'm cut out for the movie business after all huh my friend you're a sentimental thug with zero artistic training and nothing interesting to say I would say you're overqualified Whoa. <laughs> anyway shut up and take a look at that Ooh. oh oh okay fucking a feels good doesn't it feels like I've finally done something with my life actually done something Move. Welcome to show business. Nothing but make believe will ever feel quite real again. <laughs> All right, Michael, come on. Let me show you some rushes. I think you're gonna love it, but it'd be great to hear your notes. Hey, baby, I just wanted to tell you, I'm finally doing something with my life. I'm making a movie, a real one. Call me. Michael finally has um, found his purpose in life. What? What? It? The more down. Hey, what you doing here? I mean, I'm real glad you're here. Come here. Come I on. can't stay. What? What's up, babe? No, it's Lamar. What that fool want now? It's your best friend. He's your best fucking friend. For real. My best friend. My homeboy, right? My nigga. Man, fuck you. I mean, not like that, man. But no, he ain't. He just another nigga from the hood. Him, stretching all the motherfucking clowns. All he want to do is drag a motherfucker down and live in the past. And this is the future? A big empty house with nobody who gives a fuck about you. Well, shit, Ooh. it works for me. It can work for you, babe. I'm getting married, Franklin, to a doctor, not a murderer. Well, what the fuck you doing here, Tanisha? I'm Damn. worried about Lamar. You got to help him, Franklin. Man, that shit is old. Oh, I'm a legitimate businessman now, sister. I'm a CEO, an investor. I'm a Illuminati. I'm a fucking moron, nigga. You a phony what? fuck. What? what the hell, man? I ain't saying you got to marry the fool. I'm saying he's about to get killed over that deal you and him put on with... Stretcher set him up. Oh, fuck, man. My whole fucking life I've been looking after this motherfucker and paying the price afterward. Fuck. Well, at least do it one more time, Franklin, for me. For you? For you and your doctor? I love you and Lamar. We grew up together, but this life ain't for me, and you knew that. You ain't changing. I don't care how many cars you own, how many apartments you own, I don't care how many diamonds you put in your ear. It ain't for me. Not done bad or done good. Hey, look, I'll change. No, you won't, and that's fair enough, but at least respect what you do, who you are. If 
you let that idiot die, you a bigger asshole than I thought. Look, he's going up to some sawmill near Polito Bay. Ugh, you do what you gotta do. Alright, alright, let's go save Lamar's ass. Wait. Oh, there's my. I was running, where's my car? Okay. Franklin, what's up? Hey, man. I'm in a bit of a bad situation. My boy Lamar got set up. I think he up near Polito Bay at some sawmill with some ball. Could you, like, do some computer magic and look into it? Is that possible at all? Uh, should be. I've got a back door into the Polito Bay police network left over from the score we did up there. Uh, give me a second here. Uh, hold on. Uh, yes. So what it say? Huh. Uh, this must be it. Uh, there are older reports of a weed operation being run by an African-American gang. Mm -hmm. uh, the files got buried, so uh, I'm guessing they paid off the cops. They growing weed up there? Growing it in the hills, most likely, but they might be packing and shipping it out of this sawmill. I'd expect a fair few of them up there. Shit. And I'm gonna need some help. Can you tell Mike and Trevor to meet me up there? They still aren't getting along that well. Oof. Tell them it's for me, and it's serious. Thanks, man. Well, hopefully Mike and Trevor turns out. Hopefully. I mean, so far it's been what? So far, it's been one wild ride, and I am enjoying. And I'm enjoying it, even though I'm just doing the them storyline missions. This game is fun, to say the least. As long as it doesn't involve planes, I. As long as it doesn't involve planes, because the play. Because because I've been saying this for a tons lot of times, and I'm gonna keep saying it. The the controls for the planes in this game suck. Probably the same goes for the swimming, but the swimming I can is still I can I can still tolerate because there's rarely any swimming in the storyline missions. But this game. Is gonna force you to learn how to fly a plane whether you like it or not especially doing um, any missions that involves travel I just I uh, from I, I know this any mission that involves travel is very high likely you're gonna do some flying anyhow let's whoa and look and looks like it's gonna take a it's gonna take a while for me to reach the um, this the, the sawmill. The palito ah oh, the palito job the, the the bank the bank heist the bank heist yeah I remember that. Oh, damn I didn't think didn't expect you. But yeah it kind of makes sense because we're going going at a, going somewhere at so going to a sawmill. And did I have I upgraded this car? I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember whether I've upgraded this car or not. Because just so you know, car cars in this game are upgradable. I'll just you I'll just you turn my ass right up. I think this is the world where we race with um What the f That that animal came out of the way and it and it and it ran on my on my car like what the hell And yeah this is the world where we were um, where Mike and Trevor were racing back after they are checking out the the bank Nice and slow, nice and slow, nice and slow. Yeah, yeah, this is the, this is the exact same road as um, when uh, Mike and Trevor were, were racing back to Trevor's um, office. 
Gotta be careful, gotta be careful. I don't... Wait, there's a shotgun here? Oh, there's a shotgun. Hell. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. Why'd you invite this stoolie, huh? We want Lamar to be rescued, not sold to the feds. Give it a rest, asswipe. Man, what y'all two shut the fuck up? Now let's take a look at this place, man. Lester said this was some type of big weed store spot. The place is crawling with ballers, you know? Now me and you, we don't mind the old gang warfare, but suede bucks over there. <laughs> yeah. Tell Trevor I said bite me. Now I said shut up. <laughs> now I see the oh. weed, but where the fuck is Lamar? Oh shit, oh. there we go. I see, yeah. yeah. Tell Trevor I'm, I'm gonna on be up left. on this hill with my rifle. I don't want to be anywhere around him when he fucks this whole thing up. Classic. Classic, huh? He's already planning his escape. Oh, fuck. Oh, now we can join him. Get into an assault position. I saw a few possible entry points when I got here. One, the front entrance on the right there. It's the most direct way in and most likely the heaviest. Two, down the hill to my left. There's a bulldozer there. Might be able to use it in the assault. Three, the other side from me, by the railroad. Should be possible to avoid the worst of it that way, but I won't be able to cover you. All right, thanks. Don't shoot and don't get too close. We don't want them to know we're here until we want them to know we're here. Ah, uh, okay. You're the expert in springing attacks on the unsuspecting. So long story short, get into position. Get into position first. I'll, I think I'll take the bulldozer. Yeah. I'll take the bulldozer route. Yeah. I like the look of the bulldozer. It'll cause some damage. Alright, my turn to move. Hey, I got a good vantage. I'll see what I can do up here when the time comes. Wow. We stand a better chance if we come at him from two angles. Alright, I'll take that on board. Okay, it looks like um, Franklin will take the Frank, upfront. We'll attack on your signal. Alright, let's do this. I'll take out wherever I can. I'm moving! Alright, let's do this. So, I believe Franklin is... Um, Mobilize, motherfucker, this shit is on! That's the food that's for family set. Lamar! Lamar! Down. I think he's down. What the hell? That's Franklin. Okay. Ah, missed. Ah, screw the head. I see Trevor. Come on, hurry up with the, with the reloading. This one on top. I need a good view. Um, swapping to Franklin. Sniper fire! Oh, now you need me. And now I had to um, swap to. Okay. 
AK swapping to Franklin. to the zombie I see it. got it got it I forgot to keep an eye on my HP. <sighs> Shit. I forgot to keep an eye on my HP. My bed, my bed, my bed, my bed, my bed. Crazy dude here too. Hey, Trevor. All right, Lamar, let's go. You're lucky we're not taking your pot too. We go up this way. We'll have some. Swap to Michael. That's the thing, and I can't move. get a view from that from um uh, from Fra uh, Franklin's um point of view so uh, I'm sorry I mean Michael's point of view bye thanks is we ever gonna get a proper introduction dog all right you too go 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 T call me dog I'm gonna come up to the unicorn and get horny on your office supply you slipping fool Shit, homie, you all right? I'm straight, homie. Bitches got to jump on me, though. How they get you to come all the way out here? Man, I ain't been let a little drive stand in the way of a money-making opportunity. Or get killed, opportunity. Man, you always a pessimist. Nah, nigga, a realist. Because in reality, all them fools want to clap your ass. Man, what a trust that, dog. I peeked out that wood chopping place when we was up this way on that Devin Weston car lift, which I still ain't been paid for, incidentally. All secluded and shit. Stretching me up, I'm like, yeah, that's the perfect place to buy cush by the busy. Nigga, perfect place to clap some fool you beefing with. Man, I ain't even know at the time. I just thought we was gonna parlay. Parlay? Nigga, please. Every time you leave the house, fools try to clap you. Every meet you set up. 
homies there for the express purpose of clapping your ass. Man, you sure? Because I'm sure there's been a few times where... No, I'm completely 100% sure. Every time, nigga. Whether you buying drugs, selling drugs, or discussing drugs. Talking about the weather or whatever. Man, these streets is hard, dawg. This the hood you talking about. Maybe you forgot since you've been uh, bettering yourself, sitting in that house on the hill, looking down on the animals in South Central and shit. Man, you know it ain't like that. Do I, my nigga? Because that's the way it looked to me. I'm making the best out of what I'm giving. You know what I'm talking about? I ain't in some type of mentorship program. The only mentor I got... And we gonna do something about that, dawg. Trust me. Man, I ain't got people teaching me that white-collar crime shit. Ain't shit changed for me, and you ain't helping. Ain't helping? What the fuck you call this? Me, Michael, Trevor, we all came up here to help. The unholy fucking trinity. Ballers beware when these fools rolling together. You jealous of Michael and Trevor? What happened to me and you fucking shit up? Form gangsters, nigga. So I shouldn't have called them, right? Man, I was doing everything in my power to make sure you wasn't clapping. I can make sure I ain't clapping. Clearly you can't. Next time, homie, don't come. And hey, matter of fact, if you do come, don't bring them dudes. Man, look, let's not talk next time. Next time, don't get your ass in the situation, all right? It's the hood, Frank. That's what happens in the hood. No, the fuck it don't. Not for everyone. I'm one of them dudes that it happens to. Man, you gonna tell me what was going on back there? Hood shit, homie. That's the shit that's different from the country club shit your overpaid ass is presently accustomed to. Man, stress put us on this shit, man. Man, we gonna get on his ass. Man, fuck that, homie. Look like I give a shit. Nigga, I give a shit. Stress do what he do. Niggas want me dead, be dead themselves. I ain't gonna overreact to shit. Overreact? Man, that nigga Stress tried to get you killed, nigga. Nigga, that's the hood. I'm still here, ain't I? Jess. You sure Stress knew they was gonna book me? Yeah, nigga Stress knew. Everybody knew Stress knew. Tanisha knew Stress knew, and she don't even come around the fucking hood no more. Damn, that nigga Stress janky like that? Man, you don't see this? Man, Stress been screwing us from the start. Like from back in the day? From like the other day, dawg. Since after we went to the recycling place and D and them ballers try to take us down. But Stretch put in the work on D. Yeah, man, that's survival. Remember how angry his ass got? Especially with you bringing him into this shit? Aight, aight, but tell me this, though. If Stretch was fucking with your boy LD, why he set us up with the deal for the brick in the first place? He go off and make peace with the ballers, come back, and then put us on the lick on Grove Street. Man, you remember Grove Street? That brick was drywall. Ripping us off was probably Stretch's ideal anyway. Damn, you think so? It makes sense, don't it? Man, I ain't knowing, man, maybe. Man, Stretch got in with the ballers when he was inside. Played us as Marks, dog, but a bunch of them got booked. So now they gotta come back at us. So Stretch sends you out there where they doing a the cush deal. Then you show up and save the day. Yeah, thankfully. Man, it wouldn't even be the same if your boy LD wasn't out here getting in the shit. And FC wasn't getting him out of it. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> man, I don't know. That shit was fun, nigga. Don't tell me you didn't enjoy scrapping like we did back in the day. It ain't back in the day no more, dawg. But it felt like it was. Okay, fools. It was fun saving your useless ass one more fucking time. There you go. That wasn't too hard. You should have seen your face when I came in. You was like, shit, shit, shit. Hey, shit, man. Oh, bullshit, nigga. <laughs> you better check them trolls, homie. You probably shit it yourself. Fuck you, man. I don't care if I die. It's a compliment if they send an army after a nigga. They only send like two of the little homies to get you. Nigga, you didn't look like they was paying you no compliment, nigga. Must have just caught a glimpse of your ugly ass. Nigga, you think I'm some angel come to take your ass somewhere you never going to. You pray to your white man God, homie. I'm going to the Great Plain Beyond where the buffalo keep on roaming and the little squall bitches want me to nut on their face all day. Bitch, please. <laughs> oh. I'm just glad that throughout this entire tr uh, road trip back to um, to Lamar's home or wherever it is, I'm just glad there's a long there's a long ass dialogue. I'm just glad. Yeah, and I believe we're back at um, Frank Franklin's home or some sort. Yeah. <laughs> so I guess I guess what we learned is. Nigga don't think it ain't no fun if he had fucking with the homies, nigga. You feel me, my nigga? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess you can look at it like that. Hey, but on some real shit, my nigga, um, you know your nigga out here doing BAD, man. Why don't you slide me a few dollars or something, you know what I'm talking about? 
hard out here and shit. Oh shit, nigga, that's nothing. Shit, nigga, I know you done went all the Illuminati and shit, you know what I'm saying? Leaving the street niggas in the back, but damn man, uh way to keep a nigga down, my nigga. I mean, thank you. I guess it's payment for all the work a nigga put in for you getting them cars and shit, you know what I'm talking about? Give a nigga just enough money to get him a little 40 ounce in the bucket of chicken on the way to the pole house, huh? Man, don't be like that, dawg. Because number one, I never got paid for them motherfucking cars. Number two, I saved your motherfucking ass. <laughs> no matter how many times you and that tiny motherfucking brain of yours to try to get us killed, I saved you, dawg. you supposed to, my nigga. I thought we was homies for life. Me too, but I thought we was trying to get out of this bullshit. You live in a fantasy, homie. The best thing you can hope for is a big turn off of your motherfucking funeral. Nigga, ain't nobody coming to your funeral. <laughs> what? Man, what about all the motherfucking times I saved your life, homie? What about that? Oh, thank you, homie. Thanks for leaving your nigga in the backfield. You know what, my nigga? If your ass can just act civilized, you would get some work. But instead, you want to be this game-banging, mad-dogging asshole. Oh, my bad, Mr. Gold Car. Excuse me, sir. Thank you for helping out a post street nigga like me, sir. You can go now, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Nigga, who you think I am, nigga? Dude, Lemob trying to be no, so, uh, steal up, something. Nigga. I something thought we sort. was homies, nigga, but that's some shit that just got past you, my nigga. You know what, dawg? If something good comes up, I hit my dude, man. Chill out, all right? Yeah, whatever, nigga. You just hit me when you find out what the true concept of friendship is, nigga. We came from the sandbox together. I know that. I got you, dawg. If something good come up, I got you. Yeah, whatever, nigga. I'm in the turf, nigga, if you remember where that is. Oh! What's up, player? Oh, what the oh, hell? Right. Man, I don't know y'all. We done, Hey, man. we ain't done yet, homie. Not yet. Nearly. Man, what the fuck y'all want me to do? Kill the president? Fuck his wife or something? Or invade some fucking country? <laughs> no, no, something more sensible. Something that's gotta be. Hey, when the timing's right, you're gonna take old Trevor and put him out the pasture, homie. Michael will be sensible, but Trevor... Trevor won't be. Trevor is a liability that none of us can afford. Man, Trevor saved you. He saved both y'all ass. And it's unfortunate. Hey, when we give you the word, you're gonna do this. Whoa. Man, get Michael Wait. to do it. Me and Trevor cool, dawg. Michael can't do it. Trevor won't let him near. That's why it's up to you, homie. What the hell? Hey, who is that? Nobody. Don't worry about it, nigga. Hey. Lost an ass, nigga. What the hell? Now they're asking Franklin, Franklin to kill Trevor when the time comes? Ah, uh, accuracy and mission time. Hello, hello. Wha Good to see you, Slick. Oh, what the Devin. hell? The hell are you doing here? It's over, Michael. You done good, kid. You kept this bullshit up long enough to help me trigger a fantastic insurance payout when the plug is pulled. I love you. You're you're like my spirit brother now. Where's what Solomon? He's out getting the negatives of film, whatever the fuck it is. The last dinosaur in town is about to get fossilized. What are you talking about? Look, the movie's nearly done, so if the plug's pulled now, the investors, meaning us, get a massive insurance payout. Meanwhile, I can use that to get the other major shareholder, the old bastard's idiot son, to agree to tear this relic down and let me redevelop the area for condos. What? <laughs> In this economy, the city's gonna let me build tax-free. I might even get some rebates. It is a brilliant thing, and it is all thanks to you and Molly's eye for the details of the insurance policy. Michael, they're fucking us, the suits! And they don't even wear suits, wolves, and turds clothing. Try not to take it too badly, Mr. Richards. Were you ever a human being? Well, people used to like films. Now they like what? Videoing themselves, beating off on their iFruit phones. Don't blame me. I'm a very spiritual person. I feel badly about this. But evolution is evolution. Gentlemen, Molly, namaste. Can I take the film now, Mr. Richards? Nama, go fuck yourself, you monkey-ass piece of something? shit. At least let me finish the picture, then close the place down. I'm afraid our timetable doesn't allow for that. Goodbye, Mr. Richards. Where the f with that movie? She is taking the only copy offshore, somewhere nice and discreet. Analog! God, it's certainly got its complications. Michael, can you do something? 
No, he can't do anything, pal. It's an inevitability. <sighs> My wife got screwed by a yogi. And now I'm getting screwed by a yogi? Fuck! That! I'm a producer! Nobody fucks with my film! Exactly. Get to the airport, talk to her. That's it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This... Yeah, I'm using, this is my this is my own car. Shut up! You're not thinking. Hey, I'm a producer. I'm producing the goods. Don't do this, Slick. Think. She's got a police escort. She's on the way to my personal hangar. Security at the airport worked for me. Like I just want to get the film back before she does anything rash with it. Molly's highly strung. She's not going to stop and talk it out with a deranged killer chasing after her. That ain't who I am today. Look, I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want to get my movie. Slow down and use your brain. Fun time is over. So many corrupted a holes. First the FIB and now those 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 two mongrels. Sad because Molly's kind of hot. It turns out she's just a nut. She's just a. What was the other word again? Ah! Uh. What was it? What, 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 what's that? What's that word? Ah! I remember. A Jezebel! She's nothing more than a. than a Jezebel! Excuse me while I bring my while I'm hunting down this Jezebel. Oh hell. The shop there is no need to panic. The LSPD are here to escort you to the hangar. My my objective is to chase after her right now. Yes. What the hell? Just chase after me. Whoa, what the hell? Continue chase after her. She's a Jezebel after all. I mean, look at the way, look at the way how she's driving, man. What the hell? Oh, oh, oh! The plane! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! This is this is crazy, man. This is crazy. You're playing chicken. No, I'm not. On the floor, lady. On the fucking floor. Save me from this murderer. Molly. He killed people. Help me. Move. Hey, I'm not hey, coming. Stop. Oh, stop. Look out. Wait. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh. 
Good thing I'm wearing the armor. All this mayhem! Nothing to do with me! I got what I came for! I'm leaving! Trespassing! That's the most you got on me! Good thing I'm wearing an armor. Sorry for killing you guys, but I got it. Hey, but I got to bail out. Hey, I'm just a witness, okay? Now get out. I'm out. Bye. Bye. What the hell? Holy hell! Didn't expect her to die that way. Like that was nuts. Now I gotta lose these cops? Holy oh, hell. Oh, come on, you've got to be kidding me, right? You've got to be kidding me, right? Wait, 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 wait. Oh damn, dead end. Oh shit, bro, wait. Maybe I should have U-turn and grab my own car instead. <sighs> damn it, I should. Run. The one behind this. Hey, you got some mess to clean up. Leave me alone. Guess I'll take her car then. Oh, hell, did in? Not really. Oh man, you can't be serious. Damn it! I'm being spotted. And holy hell, there's a lot of cars. Get out. Out! Out! Find an underground bridge of some sort. Why am I going here? They can't spot me, can they? No, 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 wrong, wrong. Let's 
Screw it, I'll just keep running for now. Another one. Right, let's let's head to the uh, the next one. Alright, let's head down. Move, damn it! I have a ah, shoot! They got, they got me, they got me. Oh hell, did it? Clean escape, use hound. <sighs> well, that was wild. The producer does not drive himself to the premiere. Come on. All right into the limousine. The Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. Open that champagne, Jimbo. Woohoo! Me and the big dog getting our drink on. Hey, hey, where are you going with that? Woo! My dad's a movie producer! Really? What the hell? Jimmy, get back down here. Which makes me a movie producer's kid. Really, Jimmy, Jimmy, really? I'm gonna ride out the next two recessions without ever having to work. And I'm gonna get a sports car and a drug habit before appearing on Reality Rehab Show. And then I'm gonna sell my story and become really judgmental. And I'm gonna use all the contacts I make in treatment programs to become a producer too. And I'm gonna make even shittier movies than my dad does. I don't care about movies like him. For me, it's just an opportunity thing. Woo! Yeah! You see the Strizz Edge losers? Jizzle in the movie bizzle. Hear that, Finewood? You hear that, Finewood? Hey, I hear it, and I don't like it. We're going to the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. Get back down here. And not to, like, gawk at celebrities from behind a barrier. Oh, dear. We're actually like gonna properly get invited. Him drunk the premiere. V to the I to the P. Jimmy, read my necros entitled okay, E he's... N T uh, titles. Oh boy, he drunk AF. Yeah. Cause I am, Jimmy. Oh, pop chill. I'm done spraying this shizzle. Let's take a drink. Jimmy, shut up a second. Hey, Devin, look. I need to say about Molly, man. I'm sorry, but I didn't do it. I told you to slow it down, slick. It was an accident. I was there, but I had nothing to do with it. 
Yeah. Sure, I... yeah, hey. You made a fool out of me, Michael, and that is something I'm not gonna forget. Look, Devin, I said I'm sorry. I feel bad for you, but you don't threaten me, because this movie's happening, all right? So let's just calm down and try to be friends again. Oh, absolutely, Slick. Forgive and forget. Namaste. Hey, we're here. Here we are. Pop, you know, I'm really proud of you, even though you did make a pretty shitty movie. Well, thank you, Jim. Where are the girls? Uh, they're at home. You know, they'll uh, express their pride by showing up really late. Uh, of course they will. And uh, have yeah, you ever just a... uh, thought maybe I shouldn't shoot sex scenes in a green screen kind of environment? Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, the thought has uh, crossed my mind, I suppose. Thanks, Antonio. Give me nice and tight. Never... Paige Laszlo on the red carpet of oh, Meltdown. It's some guy. big stars, some beautiful dresses. We're gonna see some side boot tonight. Come on. We did it! Solomon! We fucking did it! Fucking it! <laughs> Fuck you, fate! I may be a lecherous old has-been, but I'm a has-been with a premiere at the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. I see you in there, kid. Hey, thanks. Enjoy the picture, everyone! Mr. Richards! Mr. Richards, hi. If I could just bother you for a second. Uh, I'm Laszlo from uh, Fame or Shame. Um, I do some acting on the side. I was wondering if... Uh, oh, yeah, of course. You should come see me, kid. I think i got a project that would be perfect for you. Oh, that's fantastic. It's called The Closet. Really modern stuff. <laughs> Pervert. Uh, come on. No, 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 no. Let's go over here. lying, okay? I never had surgery. Come on. Milton, Milton, hi. Sorry to bother you. Quick question. Get in here tight. Um... Love, love, loved the movie. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. When, when you were that polar bear and you had to eat your baby, I mean, that okay. was... Okay. All right, Jesus Christ. That was emotional. Stick I just have a okay. hug. That really affected me. All right, I gotta go. Thank you so much. Excuse me. Excuse me. Come on. Come on, let's get in there. Ah, Laszlo. Oh, shit. Come on, shit dick. <laughs> the moment he saw Michael, Girlish. he'd be like, Looks I'm like out of here. Hope I'm not too late. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Devin, the fuck are you doing here? What hey, the hell is this monkey move, ass? What's huh? she doing Milton. over here? Congratulations, Mikey. We did it. Hey, let's get a picture, huh? You, me, the proud producer. Such a pleasure working with you. You see, I was here. Unlike your wife, seems to be stuck at home. <laughs> he better not. You're a dead man. Let's go, Jim. Come on. He better not. Hold on! Where's Mom and Tracy? The girls are in danger. We gotta get to the house. Two minutes of you... What happened? I don't know. This rich asshole is pissed off at me because I didn't shit-can the movie. And then his lawyer died, and, and he just told me he's gonna hurt your mom. You killed his lawyer? And now he's gonna kill Mom and Tracy? He ain't gonna do anything if I got a say in it. But you fucking killed his lawyer? No, I didn't. No. It was an accident. I would never do anything to put you in danger. Shit. All right. Okay. They'll be fine. They're tough. This is just a movie guy, right? He, he's not a gangster or anything. No, he's not a gangster. He's just extremely rich. He says and he's got corrupted. All these connections. I'm sure it's just talk. Go, let's go. Okay. Hey. No. Shit, what's that car? All right, Jimmy, you gotta hide. I'm gonna find the girls. Be careful, Dad. Daddy's hey, home, you, you prick. Uh, One of them's in with Tracy. We gotta get in there, Michael. He's in there with our girl. Mom, Dad, come on. Fucking up. Stay here. Keep your heads down. Be safe, baby. Don't you worry about me. Clear the building! No one leaves! I told you to fuck off! Many weather? Frag out! I hope the handgun gets the job done. Oops. Not yet! Hey, put! Need 
Neither do I. Just keep calm. Come on. I'm fine, Trace. You just stay down, Let's sweetie. Go, no one's gonna kill you. Right. Daddy's got this. Okay. Nice and slow, nice and slow. Any more? Give me some cover. I can handle this with just a handgun. Oops. That that low that's gonna lower my accuracy. This is my home buddy. And no one shall and shall invade my home. Hold on, let me know first. There's one more guy. Anymore? What the hell? Got you, dick. Oh, uh, you all right? <laughs> no, it's not. What was that? Someone there? Jimmy? I'm gonna start shooting. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Jimmy. <laughs> yeah, you like that, don't you? Huh? Take it off. <laughs> oh. Get the oh. fuck off me! No. <laughs> So you sit on his face? It's called teabagging? Really? I really fucked him up good though, huh? Alright, listen, I'm gonna make a call. It's all gonna be okay. Stay put. Whew, thank goodness. All of them are alive. Pedal to the metal. Oh, I didn't drive fast enough. And I took quite, quite some time for the mission, but... Well, at least I didn't die. At least I didn't die. They came to my house, Lester. My house! So I asked the man and the kids to move out for a few days. I hate to say it, but Merriweather isn't short on excuses to come and kill you. Nor is Devin Weston. I ain't looking for perspective, Lester. They came after my family. Alright, right. right. I, I don't know what 
to that is so wrong on so many where you stand on the Union depository? Hell no. We move on that right away. Before it gets any hotter. Well, that's smart. Uh, meet me at the strip joint. I'll get word to Frank and Trevor. Alright. Hey. Sorry I'm late. Oh, we were just talking about you. Well, don't worry. Another few hours, you never have to talk about me again, Trevor. You're the one who likes to talk. Watch your back. You too. That's all I'm saying. Fuck you, though. Fuck you! All right, excuse all right, all me, right, huh? Enough! enough. Thank you. <clears throat> okay, uh, this is it. Well, we have two options. They're both a little, uh, out there. But then again, what do you expect? Okay, option one. Mm -hmm. We hijack their armored cars. We take the crews hostage. Mm -hmm. And we infiltrate the depository. Now, once you're in there and you've got the score, we send in a team of modded cars. You load up, you get out. We need to infiltrate the transportation grid and manipulate it to aid our escape. But option two, we cause a distraction out front, making you think we're dumb. <laughs> well, we've never had a problem convincing people of that, have we? <laughs> the other guys will be drilling, taking what they can. You're gonna be the distraction. Always the attention seeker. You know, for a guy who's always stepping on his friends to get ahead, he has an unfortunately low sense of self-worth. Okay, okay, let me show you the board. To uh, recap, these are our options. We try to make them give us the gold, or we drill a big old hole in the side of the bank and we take it out. If you're drilling a big old hole, you'll need a big old drill, a tunnel bore machine. I'll locate it, but you have to steal it and store it near the bank. Uh, they're excavating a new part of the metro network around there, so that's where you'll go in. Uh, mm -hmm. We'll need choppers for the getaway, too. Uh, Trevor has one we can use, the other can be bought. Oh, no, 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 not the choppers, car, no, so please, no, the not the choppers. And then modify it as much as you can to increase your chances of getting away from the cops. And it's got to be stored in a parking garage near the UD. Uh, there's going to be a lot of heat, so think about that. Um, per, I'm forgetting something. Uh, oh, that's it. <laughs> we'll need a train to land the gold on and take it to the warehouse. You'll have to steal it. Uh, again... I'll send you the details. Now, if you're interested in the more, um, subtle approach, hijacking the armored cars mm -hmm. and so on, huh? you've got to get some police stingers. And only cops are licensed to have them, so that's a headache of its own. Mm -hmm. uh, what else? Um, oh, right, uh, you'll need to get a hold of and mod some getaway cars. Uh, normal suspension's gonna give out under a couple of tons of gold. Whoa, man, a couple of tons? Four tons in total. <laughs> and that's what I can get the system to divert into the cage we're hitting. Modest class by me. Me! Okay, okay, last thing. You remember that underpass we saw from the helicopter? Mm -hmm. well, that's where I'll set up the uh, smoke and mirrors to get the cops off your scent. I've heard that before. Okay. Michael, subtle or obvious, what's it going to be? <sighs> Considering the fact that obvious involves planes I'm going with subtle oh you want him to give you the metal okay well it's gonna take a big crew uh, two gunmen two drivers and a hacker first gunman comes into the bank with you it helps you move the gold into the reinforced hot rods second gunman is there to take down the armored cars and bring the hostages to a safe house okay After the bureau, I'll stick with him. Then... And driver number one takes the wheel in the fourth getaway car, is gonna be at the bank with you and help loading. They're a key part of this. Driver number two helps you hijack the armored cars and will be in charge of replacing the tires your stingers ripped out. Okay. Only two drivers? Oh. Fine. Ah, okay. This one's new blood. I've seen him drive, but I haven't seen him under pressure. Now, the hacker, uh, they're going to break into the traffic system, buy you some time coming out of the bank, if you need it, but we might be cool.
a GUI wiki. We'll only get one shot at this thing. Is this the shot we want to take? Yes. Okay. So we need those stingers and the modified getaway cars. I knew you'd like that. Sounds kind of fruity, if you ask me. Nobody asked you. Look, this is our only hope. You control traffic in this town, you control the streets. I think it could work. It will work. Long as ready to move now. Come on. I'll take you to the equipment. Fucking asshole. All right. Shit. So wait, this police van is around here? No, 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 no. I'm pretty sure I can climb up over here, can I, can't I? There you go. Maybe not. Come on, that's just, there has to be a way to climb up there, right? Room again? The robots! They fly! The camera! The one we aren't supposed to talk about! You mean drugs? I guess you can't climb in from here. Oh, wait, there's someone. in a couple hours. Let's see that new one. The one that just came out. It's about the finance guy. What's it called? Meltdown. Anton Bartolaire, yeah. Lot of bunch. We're talking statues. That went smoother than I expected. That went smoother than I expected. So we just bring the car right over here. Here. Underneath. Bam. Need the police van. Get the hell out of here. Huh! That went smooth. Alright, what's next? Spike strips we need. Good. Now, once we have all the modified gauntlets, we take this score.
Good as new. Hey, Lester. First gauntlet's ready to go. All right, that's good work.
there looks like the day you bought it. The second gauntlet is in the lockup, modified and ready. All right, one less thing to worry about. There you go, all fixed.
The third gauntlet's there. It had work done and everything. Excellent. I'll let the others know we have everything we need. We'll meet at the strip club. Hey, man. So we really doing this shit? Frank, come on. Next door. Ah, our network hacker. Hey, don't be fooled by the CRT and the fax machine. The hardware here is state of the art. Cute. Hey, where's the rest of the crew? Outside. Hey, good luck, homies. I'll see y'all at Mission Row, all right? Oh, we'll see you there with approximately eight tons of gold. Four tons, not eight. All right, people, let's go. Get in the car, baby. We are about to make history. All right. Let's Come on, we're this. on the clock. Let's get to the tunnel. Oh, there's a... Get to the tunnel entrance before 8 a.m., got it. This the best you could do? What are you talking about? These fucking guys? They're cool. Look, we pulled that thing with them. It went fine. You weren't there, but we went into the bureau together. You setting these guys up for a fall? Huh? Is that what this is about? If they're the diversion, maybe it makes sense. This whole treachery thing is new to me. Don't listen to this asshole. It's all good. No one is being set up. I've heard that before. Shut it, Trevor. This is the big one, and yeah. fuck me if we don't need any doubts in the back of our heads. All right, here we go. All right, trucks aren't here yet, let's sit tight. No need to panic. We I... weren't panicking. Something wrong? Nothing's wrong, we just gotta wait. You saying don't panic makes me wanna panic. All right, here we go. This I'm is it. To all right, all right. See the band. Rock and roll. More and Rock and roll. More now. Seriously? Let's go. Deploy the stinger. Now keep driving. They should go over it. Move away from the stinger and wait for the vents to arrive. <laughs> this is the part where you're going to have to foot. Get out of the vehicle! Get out of the vehicle! Let's go! Oh, shit. Move your ass! You do not want to die for this shit! Shit. Oh, oh, shit. Your move, buddy. No, 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 no. Get a fucking move on. Come on, move. Hurry up. Just hold on. Move, let's hey. go. Oh, you get these ready. Please. Let's go, let's go. All right. Yeah, we got a one-minute window before the GPS starts reading abnormal. Ooh, then let the slaughter come in. No, 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 Relax, man. I'm the one who should be crapping myself. I'm about to rob the biggest bank on the planet. Fuck! Fuck! Look! Casey! I need you calm. You're no use to me when you're freaking the fuck out. What you want to be right now is useful. Onion 86 in sight. Stand by. Hey, I was expecting you like half a minute ago. <laughs> Here you go. Gets me every time. Onion 86 in the building. Ah, oh, I see. No, I see why um, they need him alive. Cool. Good judgment on Franklin. Now then, what's next? Okay, so who's this guy? They're here. Oh, okay. Don't do anything stupid. Go, pal. Authorization. Good. Good. Santiago, what? Good.
Assist is good. Courtesy oh. escort is go. Oh, Take us to it. Follow me. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And thank goodness I'm um I'm controlling uh, Michael. Right behind you, sir. And I'm right behind you. All right. How's things? Uh, good. Yeah, uh, um... Uh, fine. I bet the freeway is an absolute B star star CH today. <laughs> B star star CH. I Tell see what you're you talking about. And you gentlemen have to sit in those trucks, bored out of your minds, staring at more money than you know what to do with. <laughs> okay. Let's go. I hope he doesn't think he get anything suspicious. All right. Collection team is here. Let's you keep ain't moving. getting through that thing with a chisel. Hey. So, you know what to do? Uh-huh. Come on. He better not be planning something, man. Okay. Gentlemen? Oh, okay. A job to do. Absolutely. Oh, shit. What? Don't mess up. Woo! There is a lot of gold in here. We're just holding on to it for the Chinese. Now, only ever want to keep it in the United States. <laughs> sure, take what you can carry. Hey, come on, come on, come on, we gotta schedule get yeah. it. Yeah. Alright. These right. are heavy. A little over two tons of pallet. Yeah? Two tons of pallet. So what's oh. that worth? Gold's trading at uh, around seventeen hundred to two thousand an ounce. Thirty-five ounces a kilo, give or take. A thousand kilos a ton, so that's Two hundred million dollars or thereabouts. Give me a seat. Yep, that sounds about right. Damn. Damn has the cargo. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. Got many jobs after this? No, this last one. He's retiring. <laughs> Exploring other opportunities. Hey, well, your chance of an early death increases dramatically when you retire. Yeah, I'll bear that in mind. Hmm. Hopefully nothing happens after this. Ah, my back! This much metal ain't normal, is it? Quite irregular. Order came down this morning, but the computer cleared it. Well, let's hope no one untoward gets word. That's what you and the rest of the security gets paid for, isn't it? Cargo's in the loading bay. Get her on board! All right. All right, come on, let's not take up any more of this gentleman's time than we have to. Ah! It. Let's go. Hey, I'm not feeling so well, and I hey, thought maybe come I could on, just, Casey, you know, suck it up. You can't handle the hangover, Case. Do not overindulge. That's right. This man right here will teach you a little something about moderation. Oh, into the other van. Got it. Got it. This van. Got it. Thanks. No. Thank you, really. Now we follow Trevor. Don't worry, Case. We move this metal at Mission Row, and you're all done. Control, we got the metal. What's your situation? Not good, man. Mary would have known we took the UD. They out there looking for you. Shit. Okay. Oh, shit. What can you do? We got the signal I had. Uh, fuck. I hope you got a solution for this problem. Yeah, don't right, we uh, swapping to okay, okay, okay. Frank. The Frank's active. 
Now you can control the traffic lights. Let's go. Good luck. Hey, we got it. Man, this should seem easy enough. Wait, right, let's see how I do this. Okay, we in. Mm hmm. Some lessons from before and got you an okay yeah, my country will have the music like the game how oh one sec oh yeah okay it's one going across the junction right behind him hey on the east side man heavies watch out okay I gotta go east here we're all Two, one, Dude. done. Hold on, there we go. Hey man, take a left. Hey, I picked up more Merriweather, northwest of your position. She wants it, and she got it. Now, this is a right, okay? Green light ahead. Now don't turn, keep going. We got a green light. Now you gotta make a right here. Okay, I got more heavies to the west. They're waving us through. Yeah, uh, make a right right there. Shit, more ain't coming from the south. This one's clear. The light is green. More mercs just showed up at the top of the grid. Okay now, home stretch. This one looks good. Yeah, enough. Oh, good. I don't know how many need it. I lost count, sorry. <laughs> Muscle up! You guys, redistribute the weight. Here they are. Hey, good work, Cap. I don't know how many uh, traffic lights I changed, but okay. Damn right, all without firing a bullet. Ah, oh, don't forget our pace here, huh? The lead ain't no, gonna no, be please, wasted. No, no, please don't. No, wait. Biggest score of our lives. We ain't taking any chances. Sorry, Pally. Well, no, 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 no. Please, please. He's in on it, huh? Get up. Hey, get up. You tell him something that ain't on the news already. This whole thing is your idea. Yeah, yeah, I, I understand. Not a word. Exactly. Yeah, I, I always jumped. I, I I never saw a thing. Go! You're fucking going as soft as that old blasted boy in your pants. This divorce couldn't come soon enough. Look at it! Yeah! yeah oh, man! Fuck. Enough! Well, first, pick a later, man, all right? Exactly. Oh, shit! Mary with Mercenary mother. Fuck. Oh, you shoot. Keep loading. We'll deal with this. Damn it, get out of the way!
Wait, there's more. Wait. Die, you Swap to devil right now. We deal with the murders. We get out. These guys are there, man. Damn. Took longer than expected. So much for the revolution. Man, we always getting fucked with. You, hold the perimeter. Everyone else, in your cars. We leave while we can. Hey, what's stopping me from riding off into the sunset, huh? With my saddlebags of bulging. Huh? Lester's the only guy who can flip metal without making a noise, dipshit. You want to try? Be my guest. All right. Lead the way. You're on me. Calling on you. All right, everyone on um, Franklin. Controlling okay. Holy hell, I just realized five star. Well, I guess this is what you get for robbing a a big bank. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. I think they just freaking exploded, man. What the hell? Okay, I win. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Was that a... So what's next? Oh, that's it? That was kind of short. All right. Those guys will take care of the metal. Lester's meeting us at my place. Okay. So let's head to Michael's home. My exiting. Hang on, we're, we're just leaving the goal. Yep, -er. Hundreds of millions of dollars worth of gold. Hey, T, have a little faith. What? <laughs> faith? In you, buddy? All right, in Lester, in the process. Come on, we've been through it a million times. Any fool can take a score. It's getting away clean that makes the difference between those who walk free and those who do not. <laughs> Man, I wouldn't know what to do with that shit. I'm guessing you wouldn't either, man. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I just have some trusting issues right now, Franklin. If we get away with this, if, and it's a big if, man, then I can finally really retire. <laughs> Watch it, Frank. Michael likes to retire with a very interesting exit strategy. Come on, man. I mean, we just took the biggest score in the history of scores. And you bitches just want to moan. <laughs> my mama never loved me. My friends never loved me. I'm mad because I'm rich. <laughs> I'm sad because I'm successful. Man, this shit is Suffering pathetic. due to oh. success. Oh, I right. am so sorry. Hey, we did it, assholes. We did it. Yeah, and that's all that matters, so... Once again, Trev among the three main guys right, uh, over here, Trevor is like, I'm so sorry for saying this, this might be a hot take for you guys, but Trevor is like the least favorite of my, my least favorite among the three. Yeah, I get it. I understand why he's, he's in this, he's, um, the, he's probably like the most interesting in, in this game. But his behavior is just like, it's just, nah, I, I, I will never accept his behavior, man. Sure, okay, I get it, I get it, um, if not for him, then things would not be interesting, but sometimes he goes a little too much. Anyhow, let's just, let's just keep driving. And hopefully nothing happens. Hopefully nothing happens. No monkey business whatsoever. And I did not expect the the heist to be quite um, a short one. Because a friend of mine said right. A friend of mine said um, who played this game. But then again, he played this game quite a few years ago. He said the last mission is the last heist is gonna be the is is the craziest one of them all. I mean, yeah, sure, it's it's kind of it's interesting to say the least. I mean, we think it. He probably took the the obvious approach. I'm not so sure where he has to like fly. Uh, the the aer the helicopter aeroplane and whatnot, but not for me, man. I I didn't make myself clear that I'm I'm flying no planes, man. No, 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 no. I ain't flying no planes, buddy. Oh, here we are. Gentlemen, uh, Lester, we have just made history. Ah, uh, I don't want to ask a dumb question here, but where's the metal? I've got it on lockdown for a few days while I'm waiting for the go-ahead to melt it and move it. Where? Where? Mm -hmm. Exactly. 
where is just the point. Let's say somebody gets pinched, well then where is the evidence? Or if anyone gets any silly ideas, then they'll just be futile. So we can take it easy, knowing that uh, it's gonna be a few days before Judas here shows his true colors. Really? Buddy. Now? Yeah, now, sugar. Why don't you take a moment while you're sitting on that big fat pile of cash to chill the fuck out and realize what's done is done. Whatever you say. Well, this is a good time. Let's this fucking fuck, 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 fuck you, you, man. Hey, 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 hey. God. For a couple of Midwest stick-up artists, you guys sure have become a pair of whiny West Coast douchebags. What the fuck is wrong with the West Coast? Oh, nothing. I love it here. Everyone's so numbed by the sun that if you use a three-syllable word, they think you're a professor. Man, fuck you. Yeah, fuck you, you high and mighty weasel. What the and hell? Don't All of a sudden, they're, they're bitching at each other. Idiot. Hey, leave Lester alone. Oh, oh, you and Lester together? Oh, now that makes fucking sense. Oh, for fuck's sake, man. You all an asshole. Man, I gotta go calm down, homie. This shit was real illuminating. Franklin. Sorry. Come on back, have a beer or something. And that's the end of the big score. Oh man. I, I was lacking of four um, headshots, but never mind. It's okay. It's okay. It was fun to say the list. The heist was fun to say the list. Alright. I believe uh, we're moving on to the next um, mission, right? Someone buzzing the door. Hey, slick, it's me. Oh, <laughs> fuck! What the fuck do you want? You got my money, punk? Hey, you got some coconut water or something like that? I need some electrolytes. Damn, it's kind of warm, isn't it? Man, you got a death wish or something. Am I supposed to kill you now? Oh, no, bro. Please, hey. do it. No. Oh, yeah. But that's my boy. Yeah, but that's my boy. He has betrayed everyone he's ever known. He's got you involved with the federal government, and he's messed up several business ventures of mine. He has got to go. And you know what? I'd like to say that this isn't personal, but it is personal. But the feds, man, the feds have told me to kill Trevor, and I obviously can't kill them both. The feds, Steve Haynes, Dave Norton, I own shopping malls. I would not employ those two clowns in. And I make one phone call, their careers, they are over. So you're going to A, listen to some 50 grand a year pension hunter, or B, a billionaire, who even the president lets finger his wife, or C, Try and be really stupid and save those two idiot mentors of yours and have everybody in the goddamn state crawling up your ass. A, B, or C. Time's ticking, pal. Beep, beep, beep. And your answer is... Man, you know what? Man, fuck you. Get genius your monkey answer. ass out of my... Total genius, but time is running. You think about it. Me, I got a triathlon coming up, and I am in deep training. Bye bye Man, fuck you. Damn. <sighs> okay. Michael does not deserve to be killed. And as much as I, uh, I will say it is, Trevor. I, Trevor is like the least favorite among the three, but. To me, it doesn't feel right of me killing off Trevor, so... You know what I'm gonna do? I got a death wish, motherfucker. Franklin? Lester, dog. Man, we need to talk. I got a problem I need your help with. Man, actually, fuck it. Man, we all got a problem you can help us with. Calm down, all right? Come to my house. All right, I'll, all right, I'm coming. Cause here's the thing. 
there's too many corrupted a holes around here. So gotta get rid of corruption. I mean, I could choose to kill Trevor if I wanted to, considering the fact that he's my least favorite. He's the least f favorite among the three. But part of me was like, nah, he he doesn't. There are people who deserve to die rather than um, Trevor. Michael, without Shadow, without, despite the fact that he. The things that he has done in the past, I feel like Michael des does not deserve to die. I really don't. Trevor maybe, but the people who deserve to die even further are those those corrupted a holes. Which is why I chose C, Death Wish. All right, this is it, the final mission. What the fuck do you think? Man, imagine a fucking scenario that will fuck things up the worst. Boy, my mind is just racing, but you know, I don't want to say something that's really exciting and then you have to act all deflated and say, no, no, it's just that somebody got the same tattoo I got, so why don't you just go ahead and tell me? Some motherfucker wants me to kill Michael. Some other motherfucker wants me to kill Trevor. I feel I can't kill both of them. Man, I'm fucked, man. I don't know what the fuck to do right now. Well, I can see that. Who are the motherfuckers? Steve Haynes, this angry motherfucker from the FIB, um, Devin Weston, man, you know the, um... Oh, that angry, that, um, rich fucker from whatever hole he hibernates in. Exactly. All right, all right, I say kill Michael and kill Trevor. What? Man, are you for real? You're fucked, you know, I, I, I don't know. You know everything, dog. I know, okay, but I, I'm sorry, I guess this is it. You know, I'm doing my best, man. I don't know how you can deal with both of them. I know, man. Shit. We're fucked. Every single one of us is fucked. Unless... Okay. Unless... Steve Haynes is under a lot of heat because of the shootings at Court Center. And Devin Weston is A, known to be a major asshole, and B, known to be friendly with Don Percival, who runs Merriweather. I think, actually, Weston owns piece of Merriweather. Uh-huh, so? Right, 11%. Pretty good for a pseudo-liberal owning a private army. So, they would both love to be involved in capturing the bullion that we just lifted. If I tell them both that you boys are at the foundry in Marietta Heights melting it down, then maybe, maybe, both of them will pay you a visit and BAM! We turn it into a, a bust! I ain't got no better idea. Alright, I'm gonna get in touch with Michael and Trevor. You go to the foundry, get yourself set up. Oh my gosh. Alright. Here's it is. What's up, homie? Man, things are kinda fucked up right now, dawg. It's all good, nigga. Who better to have in a fucked up situation than a fucked up fool like me? Man, that's what the fuck I wanted to hear. Hey, look, I'm coming to your crib to get your ass. I'm here. Right, so first things off, let's grab up the, uh, pick up the mic. So. Get your monkey ass in here. Where we going? We uh head to the foundry place. Alright, next stop to the foundry. Hey look, hear me out, man. 
If it's too heavy for you, you can back out. No drama. Hit me with it. Man, we got a real problem, dog. My boys, man. Well, we trying to save them. You actually doing something for your homies for a change? Hell yeah, I'm in. Who wanna clap your homies? Who don't, nigga? These Chinese dudes, some FIB cats, the rich white asshole who scammed us on them cars. Devin Weston? That punk bitch? Why didn't you say we was creeping on him? We ain't creeping on him, nigga. At least I don't think he gonna be there. We gotta take all the heat he can throw at us before we worry about how we coming back on his ass. But you is coming back, right? Oh, hell yeah, we creeping on that fool. Oh, so you ain't the mercurial motherfucker you frontin' ass, huh? Man, I'm just trying to make something out of myself, dawg. That don't change who my homies are, nigga. It don't change my family. Shit, nigga, you getting me all emotional now. Nigga might have to stop me from sucking your dick, nigga. Oh, please, nigga. Buddy. Fuck off. <laughs> what the hell, Lamar? Man, this town got somebody who wanna clap. Yeah, but that applies to some fools more than others. I heard that. Nigga, I'm talking about you. Everybody in this town wanna take a pop at your ass. Just lining up, capping this shit, trying to take a shot at the big chick. Ain't that the truth. But ain't nobody pissed off as many motherfuckers as Michael and Trevor, dawg. Shit, nigga, you play big, you stand aloof. Yeah, ain't that the truth. Alright, let's keep moving. I just wanna listen to the dialogue. You guys are fine. Right, here Look, we are. Man, in the front of me. Michael and Trevor, they should be inside. Can you stay out here and let us know when the bad dudes is coming? I got it, man. I'll holler at you. Right. So, they in here? Position right there. Okay. I'm gonna go over there. Right. This is it. What the hell? Um, Trevor doesn't have a. You're the building. Watch your sector. Gee, Paul, you gotta wait. Wait, wait. This is it.
aqui. Damn it. This guy still alive? What the hell? Get down. Oh, oh God. Oh. An SOS, nigga, SOS. Coming. Coming, coming, coming. What the fuck? Shh. Fuck! Hey, hey, I think they see me, my nigga. They gonna run up on me. I got this. Go help your friend. All right, all right, I'm coming, dog. Stop. Damn it! controls Hey, these the fools picking on you. They go. It wouldn't be right if I didn't have to save your ass just once. Save me? They got this one to come. Why ain't you inside with the rest of them? Swapping to f All right, I'm looking for him.
the hell? All of a sudden, all of a sudden, Trevor died. Fine, I'll try and find him. You inbred asshole! This war's on our side, homies. Say something. You know what? Fuck, screw it, I'll just follow Trevor for now. Just follow Trevor for now, damn it. But why follow? Go upstairs! And this is tough.
<laughs> what the hell? Wait, wait, wait. How many huh? tries was that like around, what? Four times? Someone else comes to kill us, or are we gonna wait till this fucker gets turned again? Oh, fight me! Ain't anybody getting turned again, and you know it. Let's right, just keep moving. It, we only just begun to clean this shit up. We got a lot of old friends I think need to be reeducated. A lot of friends. I mean, things could get really messy. No, we just gotta silence a few noisy people. <laughs> Hell yo, let me see. There's uh, Steve Haynes, Dave Norton. No, we need him alive. Why? So nobody fucks with us afterwards. What about that triad motherfucker? The one that think you two boys is dating? Shit, you know he bound to come back. Yep, there's that. Well, who's the uh, the guy who set up the mark? Hmm? Stretch? You want to throw him in? Shit, Trevor will throw anyone in just to satisfy his bloodlust. Whoa! Hey! It's called a fucking loose end, all right? Now, if we're going to be men of peace and tranquility, we tie up loose ends. Man, Stretch has been a liability. They were gonna have to take care of our old pals Devin Weston and Steve Haynes. Oh, fuck, what a mess, man. Well, let's get it cleaned up. How about you get Lester on the line? <laughs> Who is this? Uh, stop calling this number. Hey, it's me, dawg. <laughs> You're alive. I thought someone might have your phone. No, nah, no, nah, but look, I got you on speakerphone. You might make it? Yeah, I'm here. And the other one? <clears throat> See you putting the ground wheels. Uh huh. You have um, just. For a chat. No, we got some work to do. Can you get us some whereabouts? Ooh, I'll do my best. Who? Steve Haynes to start. And Devin Weston's ass. And uh, Wei Ching. W E I C H E N G. Wei Chang. Wei Chang. And Franklin's pal, Stretch. Huh. That's four. Stretch? Yeah, man. Look, his real name is Harold Joseph. Okay, well, I can tell you that Agent Haynes is taping a show over on Del Perro Pier. Shooting permit came up immediately. Check it! I wanted to ice that fucker since the moment I met him. All right, all right. Ah, I got a signal from Mr. Harold Joseph's phone over at the B.J. Smith Recreation Center. No, I got him. I got him. Let's keep him clear of uh, known associates. All right, thanks, dog. Okay. You got it. What you got for me? Tao Ching's credit card just bought a Magnum at the Beach Club in Pacific Bluffs. Okay, I'll go ask his ass about his punk-ass dad. When I find Mr. Weston, I'll send the coordinates. All right, good. So now we're controlling uh, Franklin to get rid of Mr. Shang. Got it. All right, we made our plans. Let's stick to them. We take out our assigned targets. Any deviation will lead to confusion and probably failure. We got one shot at this, guys. All right, let's do this shit. Right. Let's do this. Quite far, I just realized. It's quite far. Well, I'll do what needs to be done. Sorry, but uh, no radio. What up, Lamar? Hey, Lamar. That was above and beyond, homie. 
ain't nothing above and beyond when it comes to the homies, homie. <laughs> a nigga just wanna be helpful, you heard me? I'm serious, dawg. That's who. Mike on Trevor too. We grateful. You a real homie, and I love you, dawg. You too, homie. You done with this bullshit now? Almost. A couple loose ends. Aw, oh, shit. I know that voice. You creeping on some fools, huh? All right, nigga, we'll handle your candle. Lay low, my nigga. Okay, so how am I supposed to head up? Like, really? How about I just kill these motherfuckers? Hold on, hold on, hold on, wait a, wait a moment, wait a moment. I think I can, I can get through this. I think I can get through this. Just give me a moment. I think I can find the, my, my way out here. Maybe not. Okay, change. Just when I got them. Now what? Hey, the old man's here. He's leaving the beast club. I'm gonna do it now. Club, 
What the hell, man? That ain't right. What the hell? Side of him yet. No, 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 no. Can this motorcycle can go in, go any faster? Oh, now there's cops on both sides. Brilliant. Triads coming out. We ain't gonna have anyone to sell super weapons to either, but hey ho! Who's up? We still gotta do stretch and agent Haynes. Trevor. Bring down Haynes, got it. Radio Mike, I want a last reminder of what an annoying prick he is. Los Santos, a city of saints, oh, a city saints. of sinners, and nothing in between but the FIB. Cut! Ugh, this is crap! Who writes this bullshit anyway? Okay, all right. You got this frame drive? Mm, yeah, you're looking great. Is the chin? How's the chin? Oh, sharp. All right, the audio's clean? Nice. So, well, say something. Uh, check, check, check. Yeah, it's great. Okay, fine. We're on. I'm ready. You ready? Speed. All right, let's do this, people. Like I'm a professional. A let's go. <clears throat> Hi, I'm Steve Haynes. Oh, look at this. Is Los Santos a city of cell? Not reality. Mix. Hold on, where is he?
Um, did I get him or not? Game? Two parts diluted fantasy. One. Wait, there's a cop in front. What? Sheesh. Like, seriously, where the hell is he? Buddy, where the hell is he? Dude, I can't see him. Like, I legit can't see him. What the fuck? Where the fuck is he? Oh, now I got him. What's with this stupid ass sniper? What the fuck? Got him! Guy! That's his name, he shot him! Third time's the charm, stupid ass. Alright, let's go move! Move it! Okay, wrong, wrong way, wrong fucking way. What the fuck? Third time's the charm, turns out. Oh, well, let's see if you can find me, my bitch ass right over here. Lester, 
I dealt with Haynes. You got a location on Devin Weston yet? Yeah, yeah, I do. The Merriweather team was dispatched to protect him in his house in the Tongue of the Hills. I say house, it's more of a... Yeah, 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 whatever. I'll go up there and get him. So who we got, man? Harold Stretch Joseph. Still outstanding. I'm taking care of him. Uh, right. Why, right, Michael? Next. Sometimes I think each other. Stretches. Check that out. Get out. Why do I feel like Michael's the easiest one among them all? Crazy ass drivers. Stretch? He ain't a problem no more, Frank. Shit, he wasn't my pal. He was a dude who ganked us, homie. Thanks. So who we got, man? I'm picking up Devin Weston so he can have some uh, fun with him. Now don't worry, I won't get started till we're all together. Not properly, at least. So now we're switching over to Trevor. Oh, next stop to Devin's house. Devin has surrounded himself with Mary Red Gods. Shit. Hey, unless you got news from the Foundry team, I don't want to be disturbed. Kidnap him? Oh, this better not be one of them stealth missions.
Okay, so do we do all this way? You can't hide forever! What a pansy! And we are from the foundry team! of SP. I'm the most suspicious person you'll meet. What do you mean all our operatives are dead? I'm here for you. Okay, so where is he? Oh, inside the... Wait, wait, hear me out. No more talking. Oh, so he's inside the, the, the container, okay. Okay, what's next? Man, this mission is long. Alright, let's head to the rendezvous point, which is oh my goodness, so f I got Mr. Weston. Let's take him out of the city, make him disappear. Meet me on the cliffs off the GOH, Chiliad Mountain State Wilderness. And this mission is wrong. Then again, this is the final mission after all. I feel like Michael's one is like the the, the easiest one among the the three targets. Trevor's one's like the hardest because you have to find you have to find that. That he's target for um, using a sniper. And I don't think I've, been, I've explored this area before, have I? You're a resourceful guy getting past those trained killers. I need someone like you in my organization. The CEO position's gonna be vacant real soon, Slick. I've got nothing against you, apart from the obvious hygiene issue. Michael caused me problems, so Michael had to go. You're looking at it rationally. There are people who are useful to you and people who ain't, and the people who ain't gotta go. Me, I'm not rational. I don't care if you're useful or not. I feel like taking you out, Devo. So that's what I'm doing. This is a serious offer. Work for me. You'll have everything you'll ever wanted. All Shut I up. ever wanted is to watch you drift in and out of consciousness as you're slowly disemboweled. Yes, yes, that's the kind of creativity I need on my team. Come on, come on, let me out of here. Look, I got my own company, Trevor Phillips Industries. Oh, yeah, a fellow entrepreneur. Let me buy a shake. Give you money to grow. I don't know if you heard, but I'm kind of gold rich right now, so you got precisely nothing to offer. Prepare From for the, the last ice, my friend. You're over! I mean, that's what you get for messing with my cool. And he's I family. told them I wouldn't kill you. I didn't say anything about cutting your tongue out. Ooh. That's gonna be nasty. Come on, man. 
much, how much, how much uh, further to oh. the rendezvous point? This is why people want to kill you. You won't shut up. Ha ha ha. I realize how Trevor has half HP. But I think it should be fine. It should be fine. Oh, I think I know where the rendezvous point is. Oh, Find shut up. Happy place, you zen cock. Here we are, Slick. With a few minutes for some one-on-one -on -one time. All right. Let's see for a short while. The next day, or the next night, evening. Hey, we good, T? Never better, amigo. Franklin? I'll be here. Screwed cigarettes. So you got him? Oh, safe and so ain't that right, buddy? <laughs> hey, my hey, man, he's... homie. I pick C. Ain't that a bitch? You know, Devin, the way I see it, and hey, I'm no intelligent businessman like you, but the way I see it, there's two great evils that bedevil American capitalism of the type that you practice. Number one is outsourcing. You paid a private company to do your dirty work for you. And then you the underpaid that is. company because you thought you were big enough and bad enough that you didn't have to play by the rules. Oh, number two, offshoring your profits. Offshoring? Oh, it's horrible. You wouldn't want to be sent offshore just to save a little money, would you, T? No, Franklin? I wouldn't. Oh, no, I ain't would going nowhere. No, see, but we know your opinions on the matter, Devin. Keep your problems the fuck out of America, huh? <laughs> In this instance, when he puts it like that, it makes sense. Of course it does. Hey, Devin. Goodbye, my old friend. Thanks for all the advice. Bye-bye. Okay. Sayonara, motherfucker. He did. He did, all right. So now what? Now we keep a low profile and get on with our lives. As friends. Well, do I have a choice? No, not really. All right, then. As uh, flawed, awful, totally uncomfortable, and poorly matched friends. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, okay. Perfect. Then we can get back to the kind of capitalism we practice. Shit, I don't know how much more better that is than Devin's con. Ooh, hypocrisy, Franklin. Civilization's greatest virtue. Jesus, your therapist has a lot to answer for. <laughs> I know, I still hate myself. But hey, at least I know the words for it now. Yeah, but I hate you, and I know the words for it. So does that mean I don't have to go to therapy? Look, man. Whoa. You two motherfuckers terrify me of that middle age. I'm good. You're right to be afraid, Franklin. Yeah. Be very afraid, Franklin. Right. Looks like these three are going there. Say one ways. thing, T. I'm getting too old for this nonsense. Oh. And Michael, you better stay retired. And Trevor has left the building. And that's the end of um, GTA 5. Ooh. Ooh. And I'm sleepy. But damn, that was a long that was a long ass final mission. But I must say I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it from, from start to end. But my 
biggest gripe uh, once again I've said it before quite a number of times and I will say it again was the controls of the of how you pilot the, the plane of the helicopter I'm not sure if it's me or it's just the, the controls of the game but a lot of, a lot of missions that's um, mostly it's Trevor's mission that involves planes I it's gonna it's gonna screw me up big time to the extent like there were a lot of times I got a mission fail. Like what the hell man? And another thing then another thing that kinda turns me off about of, of this game right is the swimming parts. But yeah, the, the, the swimming parts kinda turns me off as well. Because I'm trying to figure out how do I swim back up or, or swim back down, like what the hell? It would be much better that this game constant uh, has the option to like turn on and off the the tutorial when you're doing uh, something but still this game has been one wild ride as for the characters um Franklin's alright, Franklin's alright, he's, he's, Franklin's alright, as for Michael, yeah, I kinda understand him because he has anger issues, he's trying to figure out how to handle his family and what, he wanted, he, he wanted to retire but ever since the, the very first, ever since the, I believe it was the, the one time when he caught his, um, uh, his wife cheating on him, or maybe it's just a misunderstanding on sure. That's where things just went downhill. And it just got worse when Trevor came in and met up with Michael. And things just got worse from here on out. As so yeah, I'm I I just hope that Michael stays retired. As for Trevor, like I said He's my, I he's my least favorite character among the three. But then, if not for him, the sto the story for G um, GTA Five would might not be as interesting as it could be because of probably because of his um, characteristics and the way he does stuff. I can understand why some people like him, but unfortunately, not for me. I just, yeah, it's just that some of his actions just, I just, I could not accept some of his actions, okay? But still, I, but still, I, but, but still, this game would have been far less interesting if he's not, if Trevor is not in this uh, particular game so yeah i have um i have no comments on the the music because i don't want to get ben hammered well my favorite mission would probably be the um uh, i would say the uh the f the the heist uh, at the fib really I guess, yeah, there. Were... Oh, wait, 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 wait. There, there's one. The Bang Heist. The Bang Heist is much more. That was. That, the Bang Heist was wild, man. That Bang Heist was wild. I mean, we're, we're, we're wearing armors and then we're, <laughs> we're wielding miniguns and while getting the hell out of there. Ooh, that was wild, man. That was really wild. So, yeah, that was probably my personal favorite um, heist among all. I don't know how many heists over there. Probably like what? Wait, hold on, let, let's see. Let's see. Um, I believe the the very first heist is the um the the shop, and then the the Merryweather heist. That's I believe that's the second one. Then came the um the bank heist, which is the third one, which is probably my personal favorite. The fourth one is the um the the FIB building. That's probably my second favorite, and I was really hoping that the fifth. The fifth and final heist. I was expecting um, something 
way more crazier than than, than, than than the past than the first four but it's all right it's not that bad this it's not mind-blowing level it's just basically um we're gonna sneak in into the uh the the, the big the the hardest bank the bank to to steal and then we're just gonna get out of here of course there were some obstacles all the way and then we get rid of it and then we escape through the um using that truck but and that and that's pretty much it the final heist was all right but then i was expecting something more crazier than the 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 the, the first four um the first four heists overall it was fun i mean then i mean it, i mean at least right this G i don't know about past gta gta games because the past the the gta games that i played beforehand was um a little bit of um vice city and um san andreas and from what i know right back in those days you're gonna have to where games have you have to save manually and another thing is if you messed up the mission, you have to start all over again, which I didn't really like, to be honest. So I'm glad that this game, right, gives you the option on whether you want to start all over again to get a perfect score, or you can continue on to proceed, uh, or you can continue on with the, uh, the mission, but there's a demerit. So... I like the um, I like this uh, feature that the uh, Rockstar Games added on, and overall, like I said, it's been one wild ride. It's been one wild ride, and I'm glad I I I had the opportunity to play this game. I really do. So overall, if I were to give it a score. I'll be if I were to be critical I would say I would give this a um, 8 out of 10 I would give this game an 8 out of 10 it's a fun game but I really wish that Rockstar provides or does something about or improvement on how do um, how the flight how the uh, how the helicopter and the plane controls, and hopefully they improve on the on the streaming side of the section, because you can't because I believe this is the I'm not sure about past few games, but I'm pretty sure this this is probably the very first um, open world game where we get the opportunity to fly a plane. Oh wait. I think Saint Angels does have that feature, right? I might be wrong. Then again, I'm not. I'm not really into. I'm not really like a hardcore GTA kind of guy. But I do remember how there's 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 an option in Saint Angels where we get to fly planes. But I don't remember that we we are were allowed to have swim though because I remember in Vice City, right? Once the the character hits the water, you're automatically dead. Which I didn't like to be very honest. So I'm glad that this game right gives us the opportunity to swim underwater or swim um, above surface. But I hope they improve um, on the uh, on the swimming side and on the on the flying side. And so I once again, I'm I'm giving this game a score of an, an eight out of ten. It is a fun game. It is one wild ride, but it could. But there are some improvements that needs to be made, which I mentioned earlier. And I will say this: this game is not for kids because there's a lot of. Um, language that no no kids are are not meant to learn 
until they reach a certain age and also why right, there were quite a few scenes where <laughs> kids are not uh, not supposed to look until they reach a certain age once again but then again this game is uh, a Peggy 17 uh, rated M game so yeah one thing this is game is that is a, there is definitely not for kids otherwise if I if I were to recommend this game to people I might I might do so because it is a fun game. It is a fun game. I will say this. It is a fun game. Ugh, and I'm just glad I got that out of the system. It's been one wild ride. And I'm glad I enjoyed it. And that's pretty much uh, my gameplay story playthrough of GTA 5.